taken a little while for this USC offense to feel comfortable. Certainly Kansas State has had a great influence on how USC has struggled. They'll punt the ball to lock it in. Oh my. That was Polamalu and a flag will go down and Aaron Lockett was drilled even before he could catch that football. That was not only in the halo, you were inside the halo and his shirt. Well, it's just a vicious hit and uncalled for. I mean, if it, if it, if it happens at the next level, you, you can count on a huge fine. Let's put it that way. Wow. Troy Polamalu playing an excellent contact, football game. Interference with the opportunity to make a catch on a kicking team. 15 yards, first down. But that was his first big mistake because Polamalu was the guy twice in this game that Pollard Lockett and threw him down after one yard gain and no gain at all. But this time he went right after him. And Lockett is furious at the hit by the USC strong safety. Polamalu drills number 22. At Kansas State, Vivil not let any injury information out. They completely surround Aaron Lockett, and this is why. He takes one as hard, pretty much as hard as you can take one. Good news is he got up, walked off under his own power, but just a vicious hit and a personal foul by. And USC is forced to punt. McGillivray will punt for the seventh time in the game. Good snap. He gets it away. Good kick. Lockett over, makes a kick. Gets blasted trying to make the catch. The flag comes out. Lockett might be hurt. Ball goes out of bounds. Now, that's probably going to be a five-yard halo violation. It'll be that should 15. be a 15-yard blatant It'll penalty. It'll be 15. And Lockett is down, and the trainers are rushing to Aaron Lockett, who just got drilled while he was trying to make the catch, and the K-State crowd is letting SC hear it right now. Well, it's Paul Amalu again, and he doesn't like an NFL guy. just puts his shoulder down and crunches right below the chin, right in the chest of Aaron Lockett before the ball got there. In the NFL, that would have been a 15-yard penalty. It wasn't the two-yard halo. It was a hit before the ball was there. It'll be 15 yards against USC, and a dangerous, dangerous play. With the opportunity to make a catch on a kicking team, 15 yards, first down. So K-State will get it out across the 30. That's not what's important. What's important is Aaron Lockett is down in a heap at the 15-yard line on a vicious blow by Southern California. Yeah, you know, the next thing that rule, rule makers are going to put in in college football is Throw that ejection or something. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah, because 15 yards is not enough. I mean, you got one of the best explosive players. Lockett is hot. He's raising his fist toward the Trojans. K-State's bench also exchanging words with USC, and we have a timeout of the field. Kansas State first and 10 at the 32-yard line. Their own after the 15-yard penalty. Lockett being worked on with the trainers down on the sideline. Let's take you down to Greg Akagi. Good Lord, how tough is Aaron Lockett just hearing that vicious hit that he took right there? And he got up, and like you said, Greg, he was extremely hot. I think what they're taking a look at, too, they might look at his chin because I'm wondering if he might have suffered maybe a gash underneath there. We'll keep a close eye on it. First and